Hi guys and welcome back to the 7 day market kit but marketing boot camp. Um, I realised after I shot the last video that um, I missed a really important part which is actually redirecting your domain name that you've just bought to your HostGator account. So I'm just going to show you how to do it, it's not hard and only take a few minutes and you need to do this before you download um, your WordPress Fantastico. Um, and you'll also need to probably give it 24 hours to 48 hours to what they call propagate um, which means HostGator has picked up that you've, you've, um, you, want to host, uh, you want them to host your domain name but it just takes a little bit of time for them to process it for some reason. Okay, so we just go and log into GoDaddy. Here is my account. Okay, and then we're looking for the domain name that you just um, purchased. I'm just going to set up this one here. So it'll be the domain name you've just purchased. And we look here for name servers. Set name server. Okay. Um, I want to park, I want to forward, I have hosting account with these domains, no, none of those, I have specific name servers. Now this is where it brings up these two boxes, and these are the two boxes we have to change the names and to go to the HostGator. So what you need to bring up, let's go back to your Gmail, and bring up, I'll just grab it, your HostGator um, account info, and you'll see here it says your name servers. Now these are the two name servers you need to copy and paste. Um, I can't do it on this because I've done a screen capture so I've just put it onto a notepad. I'll just take the first one and make sure you've got no gaps at the beginning or the end because it actually does matter. And then go back to the main manager and just right click paste. The next one you can take it out first if you want. Um, copy. Paste. Okay, and then just push OK. So what, what will happen now is HostGator will process this and yeah it will take 24 to 48 hours to um, show up that they're hosting your domain name. And that's pretty much it. Okay so I'll see you in the next video um, and we'll be talking about your, um, setting up some plugins for your WordPress site. I'll talk to you then.